What is up YouTube? It is Matty and we're going to try a live three star attack in the uh, Emphatic Elite versus FPC War Clan War which is a, a sort of an arranged war that we've, a scrim almost, that we've um, done between the fair play community to just keep us under practice. We wanted to make sure that we did a, a live war, not a live war, sorry, a, um, an arranged war this weekend. We've had a couple of weekends off and we're a little bit rusty so wanted to make sure we could keep ourselves up. Um, you might have seen then that my first attack wasn't successful, it was close, it was just a bit of a failure on the hog drop, which I'm hoping I'm not going to repeat on this attack. So we're going to try a Go Vaho, which is my comfort zone, I suppose. Um, you've probably seen it over the last um, 10, 15 war recaps. I've been slowly using it more and more. And what I'm going to do is... I've been just been talking through it with the guys on Mumble. I came up with a plan myself. I'd run it through with Brian um, and eBay and advise Warus. So they offered a little bit of input on on the raid itself, and uh, it's just it all comes down to a couple of things. So what I'm going to do is uh, the Go Vaho. Stewie has pointed out that the giant bomb spots one double set is between the air defence and the arch tower there. A single between the air defense and the arch tower there, and the fourth giant bomb we don't know, but we're going to guess at between the air defense and the mortar there. And that, that if that's the case, that's not a problem. So what I'm, um, Stewie entered from down by the cannon over here, but it was just about, it wasn't the right entry point considering where the giant bomb locations were. But it's a fresh hit, so he didn't know. So um, a lot of guesswork involved. Um, Knowing where the giant bombs are, my entry point is going to be completely different. It's going to be over um, basically that corner there by the wizard tower. So what I'm going to use is that cannon as my anchor uh, for my golem. So first golem drop I was going to do by the gold mine. It's going to direct down to the cannon. Um, en route it's going to pick up the archer tower. And I hope, now this I've been chatting in with a few people. I just hope that the arch tower continues to shoot it when it sits by the cannon. If it does great my life got a little bit easier if it doesn't I'm in trouble <laughs> to say the least but I'm going to drop four wizards up here on each of these defences I've highlighted gold mine, elixir pump, gold mine, barracks to create the funnel nice wide funnel there and I'm hoping that if the um, I can get one of these storages down if I don't that's kind of annoying it's not the end of the world but I just don't want my queen to walk I don't want my queen to start shooting and moving around the outside of the base Second going down by the mortar drop, a um, couple of wizards down, one by the barracks, one by the drill, one by the army camp. And then I'm going to send in my wall breakers to break open that wall. One test wall breaker as we always carry when we're going in from entry point. We don't know if there's a bomb there, mini bomb there or not. And then three um, wall breakers to do the actual breaking. And then I'm going to use a jump spell to actually, just above this air defense to open, get my... I'm obviously Valkyries, Golems, King, Queen, everything in. Use a Poison on the CC, use a Rage spell to help kill the CC, use a Heal spell to keep the Valkyries alive, and a second jump to open up uh, just over the CC to open up the rest of the base. Meanwhile, hogging around the outside, and that's basically the strategy. Um, the up, up the north side, there's not many point defense, so any sort of five hogs up there should be fine. Um, moving around the rest, a couple of giants to distract, and again, just surgically dropping those hogs in on those final defences. It shouldn't... I can't... And a lot of them are going to be distracted anyway, so I can't see any problems over there either. So yeah, I'm just kind of pumped to get this raid started now. So it's all going to depend how the kill squad goes to be, uh, as to how the rest of the raid goes. So if we check our army, just make sure we're ready for this. And let's go. Okay. Golem, what? I'm just getting ready to drop the first golem. We've got to drop four wizards quite quickly after. Golem, one, one, two, three, four. There it goes. Come on. Keep the arch tower engaged. It has, I think. Golem, two, one, two, three. Wall breaker, test one. Hit a, hit a mini bomb, good. Three over there, look to break in. Queen going in. I need her to open up over here. King over there. Valkyries going in. Poison over here to keep them sort of slow. Come on, guys. 
rage over here. Queen, what are you doing, you stupid idiot? Come on. Go back. Heal over there. Go back in. Queen, I need you to uh, be useful for once. You pain in the... Okay. There we go. A few hogs in the north there. That's going to help me greatly. Queen on queen. Queen ability to take the enemy queen down there. Remaining hogs. Giant over here. One, two... One, two, there we go. Giant over here. One, two, three. One, two. King ability. Wizard cleanup. Wizard one over here. Wizard two over here. Goblins over here. I don't even know what's going on with the rest of the raid, but we're just cracking on. Boom. I think we've done it. <laughs> I think that looks like a three to me. Yeah, look, e easy. I'd say easy. Uh, where, ah, fourth giant bomb wasn't where I thought. I thought it was going to be uh, slightly north of that. Um, I, I wonder if the king got there. Damn, that's so many hogs alive. That is. It just goes to show what you can do when you get the timing right. Um, yeah, absolutely destroyed the base. My queen, man, I thought she was going to walk. It scared the crap out of me. <laughs> Over like 50 seconds remaining. Kaboo! Oh no, 45. 45. Yeah. Kaboosh. Got the three. Let's, um, let's have a little looky loo. Uh, da -da -da. Where's the minute? Where's the moment Matt is in? Yeet it. MP. Thank you. Thank you, Van. Thank you, Brian. Oh. Uh, Pliny. Thank you. <laughs> that, well, that wasn't close. Lol. Yes, I'm glad I'm able to bring a three star for the clan. I really am, because my last one was a fail. I couldn't have two fails in a an event war. Man, that would have sucked. Um, let's look what look at went what went right and what went wrong. So the golem, I was hoping it was going to tank that arch tower, and look where it sat. It tanked the arch tower, which is great because I think my wizards were going to move into a position where they could take down one of the storages. Uh, the one. And the arch tower went down. Go on. Oh, I didn't even see that arch tower went down. That's sick. Uh, Queen decides to be an absolute nutter. Um, at this point, jump, jump spell down. Look, let the golems go in. Let the king go in. Let the Valkyries in. Poison on the CC. It's all. This is where the. This was the hard part of the raid. Getting the kill squad right. The poison down early enough to be effective. The rage there. The queen. I don't know what she's doing. Look, she's running out, running outside. Then she decides to go back in and be helpful. Um, but the wizard is under rage and he's helping take down the dragon, which is great. The queen's just being a, an absolute nightmare. But. There goes the king look, um, straight into the core. Queen is inside now, technically, and she goes and helps take down the enemy queen, which is perfect. The giant bombs are being sort of detonated, and then those northern hogs, watch those, because I knew that they, I wouldn't need much up there, because there's nothing to stop them. And if there was a giant bomb between the two defences here, which I thought there might be, I knew they would trigger it, but there wasn't, look. So those hogs actually did massive value they carried on going through there was a giant bomb which did hit all of those hogs um couldn't do much about that but the remaining hogs onto the on the on those final defenses look and um with my cleanup down early enough to be effective early in the raid yeah it all just sort of came together like a beautiful symphony of three star and anyway i'm really happy to be able to bring that to the to the clan so yeah, go Vaho. It's ridiculously overpowered. <laughs> Use two jumps, earthquake, one jump, whatever. Just You can wreck with it if you do it right. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this video, guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.